Okay, hello, welcome back to Summer and Mara, where we're going to go hunting some quests, hopefully. Um, did we have a quest with you? No time to waste. We've got plenty of seeds. Okay. We made a stuff, I sold some stuff, I did some things. We haven't gone back to our home island yet, so it's not like it's a big loop of, you know, having a lot of stuff suddenly. Hey, I already had a scuff. You didn't have to. Thanks, I already got a scarf. Mmm, smooth and smells good. Take these tiny bugs and return. Thank you. For now, everything is at peace. I still need to speak to... The mean man, of course. For you. Right. Let's go speak to him. The guy on the hill! Where is he? He's, he's over there, right? To adventure! There's no time to waste! But there is plenty of time to waste. We're wasting a lot of time. And it's literally a game that you spend a lot of time in doing your island maintenance and stuff. So it's something to casually play in your own time. Knock, knock. Please open up. <laughs> oh no. You almost squished me. What do you need, girl? I have a friend. He doesn't like you very much. What a surprise. It's Napopo. I think she hates Napopo. That, that's a mythological name. It's strange for a person. Well, my friend is kind of special. Mm, you see, Napopo is a really ancient name in Mara. It belongs to a subaquatic civilization. It is a very special connection to the ocean. I don't want to make enemies with someone named Napopo. What can I do? You nothing but take this pearl that was bought to me from the great creature. The legend says it belongs to one of those creatures. Alright, I'll take it to her. That's why. Mm, crafting something is the highest form you could aspire to. Do you want me to build your statues on my island? I forgot. Sardine! Okay, so we might get more quests when we hand in the sardine. So I should really do that next. Then, we can speak to more people. Okay, so let's go give you the pearl. Because clearly she wanted the pearl. It's in her picture. <laughs> and, um, you know, maybe this is one of the... The things for our home islands as well. Who knows? But I got your pearl, Napopo. You know, people know it's you. Okay. Just, are people not send me with you? Take this killer kind of gave me to you. It's very special pearl. Look, I'm wearing one. It's my people. Do you like it? It's pretty. Right. Do you mean someone in your family has died? I'm sorry. Did it belong to your family? The killer gave it to me for you. very sad. I hope it helps you remember your family. Okay, let's talk to Blue. Hi, Blue. I think the Popo wants me to tell you something. Yes, let's see. Pearl. Tree. Mm. I see. says that the Pearl belongs to her people. She's happy to have it back. She wants to give his Quilla something in return. I'm glad to hear that. What is it? It's some sunken treasure and the Popo will lead you to us. Great. Okay, there's no unusual errand, don't be late. Okay. So, let's go hand in our sardine! <laughs> Just land straight on the fish, sploosh. I need to buy diving goggles! Okay, we've got money to burn for diving goggles. Also, speak to Cat Girl, because she's on the way. We touched your tree. So, hopefully, you should appreciate that now. Hi, I touched your tree. Um, really? I don't believe you. I did, I promise. Do you have any proof that any witnesses? I got a camera. I should have took a picture. No, you told me to touch the tree. So if you're alone, you said you touched the tree, how would you know it was true? Because it is true. Well, all right. Take a photo. But you said too. Yeah, but I hate the one because it took so fucking long. <laughs> go, go, hey. Have I completed all your quests? Sorry, girl, I have to cook. Come with me, touch the tree with me. That's not meant to sound at all. Come, come touch my wood on this haunted island. <laughs> Foggy bin. Ate a lot of trash. You know, do you want to, do you want to come touch the big wood at the top of the haunted island with me in this, in the spooky graveyards? 
I swear, it's not a pickup line. <laughs> I'm not inviting you to come shag in 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 the the spooky cemetery. It does sound like a good pickup line for for girls who are goth. Hello, please be quick. Please, be, you want a jab down? Well, it's not very big. Still do jam. Sardines aren't big. I'll oh, well, a good meal. Caleb loves baked sardine. Yeah, take some more bait. Different types too. Did you know the prawns used to be enormous beings? You could ride one of them and your head would still stay above the water. They, they were used in terrible wars. At least that's what I've been told. The truth is I've known them to be tiny, but it's important to have respect for the prawns. Okay. Uh, now go see Sammy, she's waiting for you. She called and asked me to let you know. She's like, okay, I saw you. Because, you know, we have telephones here. A couple of rods. Collected some shells. Now we only have to pick the price tag for the tourists. This way the one for ancient shells won't be forgotten. Ancient? But I just found them on the beach. Yeah, they're ancient shells and nine-legged hermit crabs. They look like regular shells to me. The nine-legged hermit crabs are magnificent creatures. Their extra leg allowed them to throw precious metals at the bottom of the sea. However, they disappeared many years ago. The Guido used them into gold mines. Until then, they became extinct. Jeez, that's sad. Some poor hermit crabs. Yeah, take this shell of a nine-legged hermit crab. This way you won't forget them. Thanks. I'm taking this backpack as a gift, it's a special offer from the shop. It's my lucky day. A fishy backpack. I have a little task for you. Say me, these, these products. She called me by phone. Get into the light as soon as possible. It's a good job I talked to you twice so I didn't have to run back and forth, isn't it? You could have just said this before. Go away, Kara. You know, that would have been useful, but obviously, you know, we hadn't technically advanced the quest to that point. But. Fishy backpack. Well, we don't have any more new tops, unfortunately. Okay, so. Go to the lighthouse, decorate our house. Fish dish. Quatery. Go to the lighthouse. Okay. Light well, lighthouse is co quest as well, so, you know, maybe some more will dawn after we go to the lighthouse, but there's nothing on the way. Like, you know. <laughs> Sorry, it's a telephone call, not being racist to you. <laughs> no, I'm not in. Go okay, bye, cat girl. Uh, I wasn't inviting you to come touch my woods on the haunted treehouse. Have we finished her quest line? I don't know. I don't think so, but she's now saying different things to us. I run the world's longest way around this island every time. I run out to the right and then I run up to the left to get to the lighthouse when, you know, clearly the most direct path would be smarter. I did do some looting, but I also did go sleep, which means, you know, loot respawns to a degree. So, there may be more to these lands that I haven't looted. I didn't loot everything, just anything, you know, that I haven't got 99 of. Ah, I'm broadcasting a signal in order to communicate with Dana. Um, What's Dana? She's part of Hackle's crew. She was our engineer. When I left the Navy, Donna took the post to captain. Today, she reconnected via radio, but she got lost amongst the interference. I think she's very far from all radio. Doesn't have range. Um, Can I do something? Perhaps the antenna could be upgraded. Shall I bring it to her casually? Let's go give it a try. <laughs> She'll know what to do. But first, I got some veg and stuff for you. Oh, I didn't ask for any of these. Are you sure they're for me? Well, I guess I can use some fruits and veg. Yeah, take this. Take him this money. 95 coins. Take what I asked you, please. Okay. You, you lose your flower for that. <laughs> I missed one. Or it grew back, you know, because, like I say, they can I was just looking at the time to make sure you weren't closing your gates on me. You know, she does close up at five. Okay. Hello. Can you tell me you know what the radio is? Of course. It's been years since I last saw one. It's very ancient technology. I have one. How beautiful. Ah, uh, what do you want to do with it? I need you to improve its range. I see the antenna needs work. Can I help you? I need copper. And I need a couple of new batteries. Oh, goddamn batteries. I don't know one place in the store where you can buy them. The, the market. I'm gonna buy them then. 
They're expensive. The whole woman take advantage of everyone. I know. They're ridiculously expensive. It's a good job that I got a lot of money. Isn't it? You know, it's a good job that I started selling a lot of shit in advance. So we don't really have to. Here, I have some wood. I've got a lot of woods. And raw gold. But we can't make gold yet. But I have some more raw metal as well, you know. Just, just in case I need that, that extra little injection of cash. Okay, batteries. It'd be nice if it just put ones that you can do at the top rather than, you know, people order. I think that would be a quality of life improvement. It's like, you can do these. And then, you know, anything you can't do goes to the bottom. And anything that's most important to do goes to the top. You know, it's like, this will open the most quests for you. So it goes to the top. But I can see why they don't. Like, you don't sell batteries. You do. Hello. Oh. You need some Batteries, please. Anything else? That's all, thank you. <laughs> Slow down! What's wrong? I see you only need our products. We won't be cheap. I can pay. Oh, uh, we don't want your money. No? No, we need you to do some for us. What is it? We don't see you rework that boat. Yeah, would like to take this box to a submarine trying to get rid of it. What's in the box? Did we ask you what the batteries are for? No. Well, there you go. Okay, okay. And take this box to the train, throw it in, come back. Have your batteries, boy, then. When they harm the ocean. You never do such a thing. It's all organic. Anywhere in particular in the open sea? Oh. Okay, I have to go to the quest. To so the map. I just out into the open sea? Okay, I can do that. My boat is a bit of a way away. You know, just as long as I don't have to go far. I can ironically park my boat a mile away. I can go out into the open sea and dump it. I half considered buying the batteries, but it won't let me progress the storyline just by buying the batteries, I'm sure. You know, we've got to go dump this out into the sea. And yes, it will absolutely harm the sea. Transport the mysterious box to the open sea and trust this, like every other bit of trash out here. It just doesn't hurt Mara. Those women are a bit scary for sure. What would have been interesting is if it had left it floating like the other pieces of trashies that you see, like the boxes and things. That clearly a lot of people have been doing. <coughs> clearly the ladies have already been doing. I've been cleaning it up. I've been I've done my share. Equivalent to exchange, you know, we we now dumped a box. You saw nothing. You saw nothing, good adventurer. We're just going to eat infinite apples. Because you know, it's literally the first thing. And the energy and stuff that you don't really get from the other things. It's not really worth it. You know, just eat the apples. You know what? I might spend the night and think if it's going to get dark. I don't know. I might pay for a night. Because we've got a lot of money now. Hi. It's gone. Here are the batteries. Thank you very much. I didn't look inside the box. We hope so. Promise. We believe you. Don't worry. If you need anything else from you, we'll let you know. That would have been a lot of money. Metal axe. Okay. Do you have any quests? Do what I asked you. Come on. Do you have any quests? Ah, Koa. I'm kind of worried. I've seen those elites around. And my diary doesn't say nice things about them. Yeah, I'm looking into that. Would you mind investigating a bit for me? Of course not. What do you have to do? There's an island up north from here. It says it's an island full of life. Huge palm trees, wild animals, and little keto farming settlement. Okay, take a look. Bring me a flower from there. I went to see it. The elites went uh, two or three months ago. I clearly didn't dig it up. Go, adventure. I'll do what I told you to do. Clearly didn't dig it up. I must have missed it. 
Unless it only spawns now. It's closed. Oh. She's going to be closed too. Because, you know, the hours of business. Batteries, Koa, Koa, Statue, Koa, 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 Koa. You're the only one that's no ho. I need to go pay no ho. Visit the island. But because she's not open, we're going to our boat to sleep. Because, you know. The only way, we don't really gain a lot. You know, if we were half full of energy already, you know, you'd think you'd get more energy, but you don't from sleeping when you've already slept. Okay. Chickadee, we will go back to my island eventually, I promise. I promise. I promise. <laughs> eventually. Okay, alien squirrel. I want an alien squirrel on my island. Okay, so. You don't open till 10, but that's fine. We're not concerned with you. She is already open. I don't know if she opens at 9, but you know, obviously it's already past 9 by the time we get here. <laughs> I got some batteries in copper. Um, what the materials need to repair, same as radio. Hmm. Great. Look, I've replicated the radio and mod noised it. Here's yours in case you want to keep it at home or whatever. Hmm. Everything's done. Thank you very much, Kelly. It's been fun to be honest. I don't always get a chance to work like this kind of technology with Sam's. I could bring the upgrade radio back to Sam's. Portable radio and a fixed radio. Mm. As that little task. Okay, you don't have any other tasks. <coughs> you know. Just try to min max all the tasks that I can grab to minimise running backwards and forwards. Just don't mind me. <laughs> Here with your radio and improve it. Thank you, was that expense? Nah, don't worry. Now what? Um, look, I see the radio signal like from Dunnar. It's an island located to the south. I don't know how it looks now after what happened. It's the volcano. Uh, do you remember the flower you gave me? Yeah, it'd be a good idea to take it with you. Yeah, good now, you're ready to go sail. I uh, made a rock sack for you. How beautiful, thank you very much, Sing. Oh. You're welcome, kids. Notion backpack. Take what I asked you. Okay. Travel South, Advanced Quest, Advanced Quest of Mayo, Naze. We did some Mayo stuff. Advanced the Quest of Koa, okay. Caleb, we need to cook for. Dive into the sea for the Quay Tree. Take No Ho, okay. We can go paint No Ho. And then we got on, though. Leto. Leto, did they know? Okay. Don't run the hugest lap. Oh, there's honey or bees or something honey <laughs> I knew it was honey we got your money honey we got your disease no <laughs> off we go past the invisible walls don't mind me we we'll give our money to no ho. Well, first we steal water. But the water was dry. The water has gone dry. Okay. I have some stuff for you. Um, I know. A woman is isolated and large. She never comes out or thinks about herself. We have to take us some food or see what it needs. Something Caleb and I have been doing for a while now. I met a person like that once in a small town south of East Rio. It was a huge island with a little valley in the middle. And a castle in the middle. The person lived locked up in that castle. Or maybe it was a ghost. That's scary. No dad approached the castle. They said that it was haunted. We saw them some beautiful vases. Oh, the vase islands. The ghosts. Mm, yeah, that ghost had a lot of money. The sun lords. I've been to this island though. No, oh, you look tired. I'm hungry. Working in the shop all day. Where's the appetite? Can you stop and eat or something? Of course not! What if a customer comes in? There are not a lot of people come, right? Some will come, you'll see. By the way, I love tacos foods. Clams in the air! Get away, Kara. Get me my clams! Okay. Grumpy. You're an absolute grump when you ain't had your Snickers. Eat some nuts. Prepare a seven of clams. 
Not right now, Cola. Oh, it's too liquid. Try again. Oh. All right. Yeah, he's learned to make a foamy milkshake. It's our family recipe. My great 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 grandfather was to make an incredibly foamy milkshake. Or at least that's what my father and grandmother used to say. So Bram has to learn it too. He doesn't have choice. His mother left him on the bank for a few months. And now where am I supposed to get foods? You can always go to a wine restaurant. Good idea. Not really. I was joking. Let's go on to make some kind of quick shop. There's no time to waste. Mm -hmm. I can't make clams. Okay. Two or one. Again, running in circles. <laughs> so I try to get as many quests piled up. Ryan, can you make a very special dish? Sure thing. It's my cooking a new soup. I'm cooking new soup. It's called fish soup, but I'm missing one ingredient. What is it? It's it's very mysterious ingredient. Strange. Uh, something. A brand new pumpkin. I got some. I'll get you some. Will this pumpkin be enough? Yes, perfect. Now we only have to scoop it out and cook it. Well done. I hope it's good. I'll take it to no hope. To no hope? Yeah. You can't leave the shop unattended, so I went to find some food for it. But the key to hate me. Not at all. No, only hates people who haggle. Yeah, it's gonna be a mess. Fish soup! This isn't clams, man. Yeah! <laughs> also, that fish looks disgusting. He is very hungry. Uh, thanks for doing the task. Kawa, kawa, kawa. Hello, sheepy. Froggy bin. With the love. <laughs> we had to wait for the love. Okay, more trash for Froggy bin. Yum yum. You know, someone could have literally put that in the bin. It was right next to it. You no excuse. <laughs> okay. Hello, I got someone you might not like. Where were you? I'm sorry. <laughs> Easy. I got some really tasty soup. I want a clams. This is really good too. I promise. Nice try. Mmm, delicious. Taco is genius when it comes to keto cuisine. It's the ones. What? Oh, please. It's disgusting. Oh, that ankle is weird stuff. You said it was tasty. I can't your mind. Can you heard about the Kitu Islands? Uh, it doesn't ring a bell. It's mysterious islands. A bit far away. Completely empty. Except for some strange vases. I've been there. They moved when I was looking at them. Are you sure? It sounds like a lie to me. I'll give you my merchant's words. Letting go of their really shy animals and turn into vases. They only found on that island because they don't know how to swim. Some time ago, Caleb and I went drawn by the idea of some luxury vases. However, each time we loaded one into the boat and turned around, it was gone. In the end, we didn't get anything. Wow, now I want to see the islands. I can show it to you on the map. Now that you're going there, would you bring me some of the fruits that grow there? They look like oranges, but they're very special. You told me that... It so I go looking for the fruit, right? Not at all! The island was amazing. I've already been there. The virus has truly moved. But the oranges were pretty normal. They're very special oranges. Caleb and I planted them ourselves when we were there. They look like regular oranges, but they're oranges. Oh, I see. Here's a gift to, here's a gift to gratitude. Some prawns and thread, thank you. And the walnut floats. Hmm. Remind me someday to tell you about the day I catch Big Key. Please be quick. I'm fucking hungry. You got his food. Why, why, why can't you get mine? Okay. Donna's Island to the south. Decorate our island. Advance the quest. Advance quest. Prepare his thing. Advance quest. Dive for the quay tree. Advance the quest. Go look at that. Advance the quest. Okay. So, that's where we're going to call it a day. Thanks for watching. Join us again tomorrow. Goodbye.